Alright guys, so this is going to be the first test. Uh, as soon as you plug it in, the light comes on once to show you that you're on the first hand and then it goes off. You hold the sync button for a couple seconds. It'll blink twice to tell you you're on the second NAND. So now it is on the retail side. So we're gonna try and see if it boots. There's nothing on the other NAND, so I know that one won't boot. There we go. So let's go and finish the rest of this up. The easiest way to get into the meditative state is to begin by listening. If you simply close your eyes and allow yourself to hear all the sounds that are going on around you, just listen to the general hum and buzz of the world as if you were listening to music. Don't try to identify the sounds you're hearing. Don't put names on them. Simply allow them to play with your eardrums.
and let them go. In other words, you could put it, let your ears hear whatever they want to hear. As you hear sounds coming up in your head, you simply listen to them as part of the general noise going on, just as you would be listening to the sound of my voice, or just as you would be listening to cars going by, or to birds chattering outside the window. So look at your own thoughts as just noises. And soon you will find that the so-called outside world and the so-called inside world come together. They are a happening. Your thoughts are a happening, just like the sounds going on outside. Everything is simply a happening, and all you're doing is watching it. Now, in this process, another thing that is happening that is very important is that you're breathing. And as you start meditation, you allow your breath to run just as it wills. In other words, don't do at first any breathing exercise, but just watch your breath breathing the way it wants to breathe. As you watch your breathing, you will become aware that both the voluntary and the involuntary aspects of your experience are all one happening. You can see it that everything is happening to you. And on the other hand, you're doing everything. For example, it's your eyes that are turning the sun into light. It's the nerve ends in your skin that are turning electric vibrations in the air into heat and temperature. It's your eardrums that are turning vibrations in the air into sound, and in that way, you are creating the world. When you breathe for a while, just letting it happen, and not forcing it in any way, you will discover a curious thing, that without making any effort, you can breathe more and more deeply. Dropping, dropping, dropping out, the same sort of feeling you have as if you were settling down into an extremely comfortable bed and you just get as heavy as possible and let yourself go listening to sound listening to your own interior feelings and thoughts and watching your breath as a happening that is neither voluntary nor involuntary you are simply aware of these basic sensations all right, so here she is. We're over here. Don't hurry anything. Don't worry about the future. Don't worry it's about the sweet. Just be entirely content to be aware of what is.
here she is. Look at that cut out. It was nice. So this is the cutout, it's all cleaned up and everything. And this is the plexiglass that is laser engraved. Came out really good. Now this will be peeled off once I have it glued in. But you can see how good it looks. Um, and I'm just gonna show you how good this fits in here. Fits in there perfectly. Alright guys, so here's the console, it is done. Now as I showed you guys before, you plug it in and then it blinks one time to tell you that you're on the first NAND. You hold the sync button and it blinks twice, now you're on the second NAND. To go back to the first NAND, you just hold it again, it'll blink once and then it is on the first NAND again. So this is not his hard drive, this is one of mine. Um, but the first NAND is the dev kit side, so I'm going to turn that on and show you that it loads. You know, really good. The dev kit side always takes a little bit of time to boot. I don't know why, but... Here we go. It is on there and it is on the latest dash for RG loader. So I'm gonna turn it off now and switch to the RGH side. It has really good boot times. He wanted a fast a console that boots fast because this current one right now that he has, um, it's really slow. Like it takes two minutes to boot almost. So, and this is all updated. 
show the boot times again. It booted a little bit slower that time. I'm gonna unplug it, plug it back in, switch back to the RG side. There we go. I had an instant boot earlier. I sent him Snapchat videos. But this is for Blinds, the owner of Arrow Stealth. And uh, so this is a surprise for him. Um, so yeah, you guys check out the server. It's a really good server. Um, and then this is the remote that we're showing earlier. You have all kinds of different options. You can change the color. I'm gonna leave it on orange. Uh, yeah, leave it right there. So that's the color of the server. So. Um, yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you've watched it for this long, then really appreciate you guys. Uh, so you guys have a great day, thanks for watching.